on tap. Dogfish Head 60 Minute IPA. Hi, I'm James Knott and this is your Better Beer Authority. Today, we're talking about a staple of the craft beer community. 60 Minute IPA from the Dogfish Head Brewery in Milton, Delaware. The brewery has been in business since 1995 and this is their best selling beer. The founder of the company, Sam Calagione, describes the beer as the basic session beer for hardcore hop heads. This is an American IPA that the company describes as really hoppy, citrusy, and grassy. They use a technique called continuous hopping. They boil the wort for 60 minutes and add hops 60 times during that period. This leads to 60 IBUs and 6.0% ABV. When you look at the numbers, you can quickly see where the beer gets the name 60 Minute IPA. Adam, how would you describe the flavor of this beer? I think it's got a really strong front to it. Uh, it, it very, very powerful flavor to start with. It's got some grassy notes. The, the citrus is very slight. There's a little bit of berry going on with it as well. And then it does linger in your mouth for a little while. Okay, and Brian, uh, the founder of the company describes this as the basic session beer for hardcore hopheads. Is this a session beer for you? Um, yeah, I, I don't know if it's a session beer. It's six percent, so it's a little high for me for a session beer. But I definitely love it. It is, it's like a staple craft beer. Um, I love IPAs, uh, and this is definitely one that I would go to. I love the hops. I love the bitterness. I like that sharp note that you taste when you first mm -hmm. drink it. Uh, it's it's really it's a really good hoppy beer. I love it. Okay. Uh, Scott, a lot of people like this beer. Is this beer overhyped? No, I don't think it's overhyped at all. I mean, people that generally only like BMCs obviously are probably not going to enjoy this beer because, it, like they said, I mean, they apply hops 60 times in 60 minutes. I mean, it's uh, a very hoppy beer. It's delicious, though. I mean, the smell itself, I mean, if you smell it, it's, it, it's a little bit more than regular beer. I mean, it has uh, kind of hints of banana, citrus. It's a very complex beer. I did not get the banana smell to it at all whatsoever. I, I mean, you can get the citrus, you can get the hops, you can get the grassy notes to it. I, I, I don't know if you got the banana. Just to me, that's what it smells like. I mean, it's just, it's Have a you, delicious beer. Do, I'm not Do you know what a banana like tastes anything. or smells like? <laughs> I mean, really. I mean, I, I've had them once in my life. I think. I okay, know, that's good. <laughs> so, Adam, where are you at on this beer? What's the big picture for you? I, you know, this, this beer is not a bad beer. I, I drank it. I, I've drank it before. I will drink it again. Uh, I, I'm not going to choose this over uh, other beers. I'm not going to choose this over do other dogfish heads. I think their 90 minute is uh, a more refined flavor. It's, it's smoother. It, it goes down a little bit better. And it has, it has disti more distinct flavors than this does. Uh, I gave it a 6 out of 10 just because of that, because of the fact that I, I would give probably the 90 minute. I'd go uh, eight, 8 out of 10 for that one. Okay. Brian, where are you at on this beer? I like it. Uh, I think it's a great IPA. I gave it a 9. Uh, the only reason why the 90 minute might, I might shy more away from the 90 minute than this one is because of the higher alcohol content and I would only be able to drink a few versus this is 6%. I could probably drink a few more. Uh, it's a little bit more uh, mellow, mellower of a beer. So I give it a 9. What's your, where are you at? I think it's a uh, delicious beer. I think it's great. Uh, the 90 Minute IPA is also one of my favorites. Uh, I'd, I'd give that one a 9 as well. I'd give this one a 9. Uh, where I'm at with this beer in general is I'd pick it over most other beers. I think it's a great beer. Hopheads obviously enjoy it. I think someone that's not even a hophead should really give this beer a chance as well because it has a great balanced flavor and it does have those kind of grassy notes but it has that citrus to balance it. It, it has a lot of things combined together that really make it for a well-balanced hoppy beer. Do you guys think this beer is balanced? No, I, I don't think it's, I, I think there's a lot of flavors going on with it, but it doesn't, it, it doesn't drink smoothly. It doesn't, all, yeah. it, can, it, it doesn't all mix together very well. You have different notes of it, but I think that's, again, with hop heads, I think that's what they're looking for. They're looking for that hop. power, yeah. that hop, that, that, that strong flavor, and then it smooths off, and then it, it goes into different characteristics. But overall, I mean, with this beer, uh, I, there are a lot of other IPAs, a lot of other very hoppy beers out there that are, I think are balanced a lot better than this one. Uh, honestly, I mean, as far as being balanced, when I, like I said when I qualified it before, for hop heads, I think this is a pretty balanced beer because, yeah, it has that bam, that pow, but it, it really, I mean, it doesn't, it's not overwhelming like the 90 minute, and I mean, it's just not. I mean, I've had a lot of other IPAs, like you said, that are very unbalanced. 
but this beer does have other things involved that you can really, I think even someone that's uh, not a very experienced beer drinker can pick out. I mean, you can smell different hints, you can taste the different hints of citrus and other things. So I think it's, it has a lot of other things to distract you from that initial bam with the hop. So I think I, unhoppy, like non-hop heads would enjoy this beer. I think that my thing would be, that this would be like an introductory for two hop heads. I mean, if you're, if you're getting into hoppy beers, exactly. this is in, very introductory. I think, it, you know, this is, this is like the BMC for hoppy beer drinkers. Uh, this is, it, 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 like, like they're saying, it's a staple. Mm -hmm. A lot of hop heads, they, this would be their, their Budweiser. This, if, you're, if you're a hoppy craft beer drinker, this is what you're going to drink on a day-to-day -day basis. But in the grand scheme of things, I think there are a lot of other beers out there that's going to have a little bit more flavor. All right, 60-minute IPA gets an 8 on the BBA scale. You can learn more about the Dogfish Head Craft Brewery in the movie Beer Wars. It's available on instant download on Netflix, and I highly recommend it. Thanks for watching. I'm James Knott, and this is your Better Beer Authority. Better Beer Authority. Better Beer Authority.